Good morning guys. AJ coming at you with another video. Today I just received a delivery from the place with the blue boxes. Let's take a look. Alright guys, so as you probably guessed it, I got a delivery from World White Corals and it is... It is a monster. I mean, this thing is huge. Um, so we're just going to do a quick unboxing to see what's in there. There's about 15 corals in there. Uh, the downside is this is going to be my last Coral Club delivery. Um, I've had it for six months. I've enjoyed it. But my tanks are starting to get kind of full. And my frag system is getting kind of full. And I'm getting to be a little more picky. But there's some live sale stuff in here, my Coral Club stuff in here. So let's uh, go ahead and take a look and see what I got. I'm gonna adjust the camera here a little bit. Maybe not, maybe not. This is probably a better view. I'll just uh, open it. You guys have seen what a cardboard box looks like, right? So I'll just let's see here. So of course, the official Coral Club little card which has the list of the corals that are with, included with the Coral Club shipment. And I only have the silver guys, because I mean, 100 bucks a month, you really can't beat it. But after a while, picky. But let's see, I got a, a Jedi Mind Trick Monty, which is kind of depressing because they sent me one last month. And I already have a pretty good sized one right there. Um, that one's fun. I think that one's from Vivid Aquariums. Um, a tricolor Poeta. Okay. A Flubber Leptosiris. Uh, a green pine cone? I think, I think it says green pine cone. And then a uh, City of Lights. Uh, I, can't, I can't read it. Whatever that says right there. Let's see. Yeah, so I can't, I can't read it, but. So, I mean, pretty cool. I've already got a few uh, tri-colors and stuff too. So, I don't know, it just might be one of those things I just grab in the frag system and give to friends, trade to stores. So that's the Coral Club. And then here is the list from this last weekend's live sale. As you guys can see, I made out like a bandit. Um, pretty happy with uh, my selection. Um, just make sure there's not really anything uh, duplicated on the Coral Club membership. And it doesn't look like there is. So anyhow, I got a two legit acro, a gonzo blueberry diesel acro, a Christmas mirabalis, cookie monster, which is probably one of my favorites. It looks a lot like something I kind of have back in the corner there. A bomb cyclone, a, another strawberry shortcake, because the one I got a few years ago, first off, is going very slow, and secondly, it looks absolutely nothing like the strawberry shortcake. Uh, the Grizzly Adams on the live sale, for some reason, that one was one of the more popular ones. I, I nabbed it pretty quickly. A Vivid's Rainbow Delight, an Ultimate Stag, which I love stags. Um, I used to have a big, beautiful one here, and for some reason, I got some sort of bacterial infection and disappeared, but um, all the other corals made it, so. Uh, a Terra Red Acro and then a Man of Steel Acro. So again, I will show you guys that. That's one thing I like about Worldwide is they do send out high quality pictures. Um, with the Coral Club, here's the previous shipments that I've gotten over the years. Um, I see, let me see right. Oh, you know what, the Jedi Mind Trick, now that I think about it, in March I changed my coral selection and they sent me stuff I didn't want, which they let me keep, which is pretty cool of Worldwide. But then they sent me some extra stuff. So I think I have a Jedi Mind, I think that's why I got the Jedi Mind Trick and I think I also have a tricolor acro because of that. But that's no big deal. Like I said, I could find people to give it to or whatever. And then of course the dipping instructions that Worldwide always includes. Now the good stuff box is huge. I don't even know if I can get into it. It's like a 12 by 12 by 12 box. Like, like my 
how big this cooler is. It's, it's, it's massive. Get that out of here so you can get some room. Of course, the worldwide coral swag. Um, looks like an insulated lunchbox koozie it's a, for probably taking corals from frag swaps home, which is pretty cool because as much as I love their shirts, I have a lot of them. Let's see. Oh, looks like I got a leak in here somewhere because the paper's wet. Look at this. Look at That's all corals. It's all acros. All acros. This month they sent out the Paula Booster. I really liked when they were sending out the amino acids because I didn't have to buy any for a while. Right. So I'm going to see if I can uh, match these up. Number 15. So this is the Terra Red Acropora. That bad boy opened. And for those of you who haven't watched my videos, I do dip and quarantine um, all my corals. So they're not going to be going in the display for, for probably about a month. Um, the ones that I plan on putting in there. They will be going in the uh, frag system. So there, there's the Terra Red. I love the way they package them. If you guys have ever done one of those worldwide live sales, they're fucking nuts. Sorry, part of my language, but they're they're crazy and frustrating and fun. Number ten. So this is going to be the bomb cyclone. I don't want to be able to get a good view. Of course, these will all color up once they uh, get in some water and, and everything. All right, let's see here. Number three. This must be in the Coral Club. This is the Flubber Lepto. Oh, look how green that is. That uh, is pretty green. So look at that. I'm trying to get the camera to focus for you guys. That won't do it, but that's pretty cool. That might be one that I just hang on to or it goes in the wife's tank. I don't know. I don't. I got a few leptos in here, one of which is green. And I don't know where else to put it. Number six, the Too Legit, Too Legit, there we go, number seven, Gonzo Blueberry. That guy's a, these are some pretty decent sized frags too. I, I, I won it, oh no, I broke it off the frag part. Oh, no big deal. Yeah, I broke it off the frag part. But uh, I wanted to pull the trigger on one of the Walt Disney, but there's no way in hell the wife would let me spend that kind of money. Even on sale, it was still going for like 500 bucks. Number nine. Ah, here we go. Here's my Cookie Monster, which, like I said, it'll color up once it gets underneath some blue light and in a more stable system that's not a plastic bag. But this guy's definitely going in here because I like cookies. I don't have 
blue monster. And it's blue. My other one is kind of green. So. Number four. Here's the green pine cone, and yep, it looks like a pine cone. And that's a good size frag. One thing I wish uh, Worldwide would do, which I know they've got thousands upon thousands of corals, but one thing I wish they would do is, and not just Worldwide corals, but, but any coral vendor, I wish they would tell you how the growth pattern is expected. Because when you get frags and they all look like a stick and they're sticking straight up on a, on a frag plug, such as number 14 here, which is, this is going to be the ultimate stack, it would be nice to know the growth pattern. You know, just that way, because it'll help with your placement. You know, a lot of these are crapshoot. You know, just look at the tank behind me. A lot of them are crapshoot until they grow out. For the most part, you get lucky and they figure it out, and it's not a big deal. But every now and then, you get oh, this one broke too. They really didn't give me enough room. Um, I mean, you get lucky and they figure it out, but it would, it would just help. You know, just be another, another nice thing to know is, is the growth pattern of the corals. And here's the uh, tricolor paletta. I'm glad they gave me this big coup because I'm making a huge mess on the wood floors. Thank God the wife's not here right now. Number eight, the Christmas Mirabalis. That's pretty. I mean, under just sunlight coming through the window. You can see how red it was. All right. A little distracted, and I'm really trying to cut down on the length of my videos. But I know this this big unboxing is kind of helping. I just really wanted to show you guys. You know, the quality that you get um, and unfortunately like I said I hate to say it this is gonna be my last coral club one um, here's my city lights something or other I don't know what, it, how, what that word is um, and like I said the, the coral club is a great job you guys if you're looking to fill your tank for you know good bang for your buck it's paced it's spaced out every uh, every month to I think three months if you want to wait so it allows you to kind of take it slow and pace yourself. Um, number 16, the Man of Steel. Yep, that, that's definitely Man of Steel. Look at the follow-up shot, like in the back. That's crazy. But so I mean, definitely, I, I, I am a huge advocate of the, the Coral Club. Um, the, the value is definitely there. I mean, essentially. Like I said, I had the silver membership, which means I had to pay shipping, so I was paying like $125 a month, getting five corals plus some cool little stuff. But I mean, it, it was it was guaranteed five good quality corals. Um, damn, this one broke too. These bags, man. I'm not complaining about the size. Those blue tips. Come on, come on, I gotta show you guys this. Come on. Come on. Oh, don't look at my face. I won't do it, but oh, it's got some sweet blue tips. Uh, so the value is definitely there. I'm just at a point where I gotta be a little picky, um, at least until I hit a big, big tank, which won't be for a while. Because in this house that we're in, the biggest I could probably fit is maybe a 210. I don't want one that's that deep, so probably a 180. And even then, where I'd have to put it, it's not really in a spot where I would want the 180. So, more than likely, I'll be going with uh, a 150, uh, which would actually fit in this same spot, a little bit tighter. This one is what's number 13, the Vivid Rainbow Delight. So, and the only the nice the downside of the 150 is. So I plan on just moving this rock structure over. And when I get it, is it just spread things, spreads things out. I really don't gain more real estate. I might be able to put like a, another tiny island here or there, but 
Um, I really need to go with the 180. Um, and then the Jedi Mind Trick, which is pretty cool, but I've already got a few of them. So I really need to go with the 180. Um, not only do I have to put the tank in a different spot, but I gotta buy another Radeon. And I gotta change out my T5s for 60 inch ones to get the filling that I want, or to get the coverage that I want. Alright, let's see. And here's my strawberry shortcake. That looks more like a strawberry shortcake, not like the one I have in here, which you can't see because it's covered by the covered by the melon ball silo. I will say, for the last six months, I've been a very happy customer of Worldwide Coils. I think. My first purchase ever with them was a coal subscription. I figured I would try it. What did I have to lose? If I didn't like it, I'd just cancel it. Um, kept it a lot longer than I thought I was going to. A lot longer than I thought I was going to. The plan was to keep it for a year before I canceled it, but I just, I don't have the room. And yeah, that's where I'm at. Uh, the Grizzly Adams, here's the one. This is the guy that everyone on the live set was making such a fuss over. And that's it. That is it for the corals. I think this is the fullest I've ever had this little container. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna clean my mess here. I'm gonna start uh, acclimating them to the uh, frag system. And once they've opened up and, and dipped them, and then once they've opened up and everything, I'll give you guys some live shots. So I'll be back with you guys in a bit. guys as you can see from that last shot everything's in the tank and looking good they're still taking some time to acclimate it'll probably be a few days before they really start to show their true colors but anyhow uh, thanks for watching the unboxing of my uh, 
WWC shipment and the last of my Coral Club deliveries. Anyhow, hope you guys liked the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Keep on reefing. Have a great weekend. And uh, if you have any questions or any input, let me know. Leave a comment down below. Everyone have a good weekend. Peace.